All right, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we're gonna to be using the MG88 Huntress on the Octane. We're gonna be using this paint color and this paint color, and we're gonna be using Titanium White Reapers with it. We're gonna be playing some rank two, so we'll get right into game number one, and I'll see you all then. Ranking into game number one, and we got Melodic on our team, uh, playing against LCT and Wellis. So let's get right into it. It's interesting. So I'm wondering how many more pro players I'm gonna be able to run into, uh, especially players from you know, places like APAC and, and OCE where they don't really have as many Qs uh, as North America does. So these players are gonna typically be lower MMR than the NA and EU pros just because they have a lot less people to play against, right? There's just less people queuing on their servers. Uh, so running into someone like LCT at 1700 isn't really that surprising. Uh, I also ran into people like Super Locky. I ran into one of the G1 guys, uh, maybe not one of the pros from G1, but it was like either the coach or something like that. <clears throat> yeah, but I, I, I've also been messaging a couple of them to see if any of them would want to make a video. So I'm, I think I convinced Super Lucky to do one with me, but it's gonna be a little while before that happens. Nice, good beat over the top there. LCT and Wellis were just in the same spot, and Melodic was able to just pop it up for me. So that was a good heads up play from him. All right, I'll cheat up here. Uh, looks like Melodic didn't go for the kickoff. I'll just let him take care of that. Melodic's a very mechanical player, I would say. Um, but... Oh, that's bad. Yeah, that's bad on me. I just didn't read where the ball was going. Like, on... Like, when I jumped here, I thought he was going to be going, like, more forwards. And he was just... He just went behind me. All good, though. Why are we not skipping the replay? Let's go. All right. All right, I'll take this mid boost. He should be able to stay on that. Well, this is the only one with boost here, so if he can get it around. Ooh, he doubled it. Uh, if he doesn't double that there, it's a goal, but I don't think he could could have really avoided that. Let's play this. Ow. Yeah, LCT's gonna have it, but he doesn't have a lot of boost. So I'll just wait, let Melodic go. Okay, it's gonna be up. Oh, it's not in. He's gonna fake that. Hit it low, Melodic can go. Oh, he's all the way back. Nice, good challenge. I just gotta make sure I don't get demoed here. Almost just got demoed. It's over. He can just go? Nope, didn't. All good. It's kind of a bad challenge for me there. Um, I should have gone up the wall, but because I was getting demo chased, I didn't really... Uh, <clears throat> I didn't I didn't get the ideal landing. Like, when I jumped to avoid the demo, I didn't get the good landing. And they just get a kickoff goal back. That's unlucky. Thought I was going to have time to get the boost there. Alright, but a lot of can go. Should be able to take this boost. Get it over him. Well, this is going to be on, but Melodic should be able to follow that. LCT gets to. I'll just let him control it. Yeah. Nice. Good touch over. Right. I'm not going to be able to follow that. I thought he was going to get that mid boost, but he didn't. Uh, okay, that should be fine. Pinch. It's open. Can he score that? Nice. Good read from Melodic. See if I can give him a high five. Oh, I almost I almost hit him. Just barely missed him. Alright. Good way to tie it up. Good touch there and the flip that actually carries my momentum onto the wall. And I'll just wait back here because I thought he was going to go for that corner. And I have pads, so I'm going to need some help. Good, Good disruption there. He's going to want to stay on that, so I'll just leave. Oh, he left the cor he left the mid for me. I thought he was going to take that. All right, good 50. It's going to be down for us. Wow, Wells read it perfectly. All right, I'll wait behind. Hopefully he can go and force it. Nice. I knew he wasn't going to have a flip there, and even if he does, I mean, he's not really going to be able to do too much with it, so I kind of just played patient, let him do whatever he wanted to. 
Good patience again. I mean, he doesn't have a lot of momentum there, so even though I know he has the flip reset, it's not like it's really going to be that dangerous whenever he does actually use his flip. Is that going to be in? No way. Yeah, it's not. Okay. But I, I know that he doesn't have, like, a lot of momentum, so he would have to get the craziest flip reset in order to actually make that into a goal. So I know that I can just kind of wait and just chill and just trust the fact that I'll be able to get up fast enough to save whatever shot he has. All right, that was kind of a bad flip reset attempt. The ball just got too far away from me and because of that, I wasn't able to get like under it and actually scoop it over. It's a good save. He's gonna have to go again. Wow, what a play from Melodic. Like I said, he's a very mechanical player. So that was just a really nice save. I'll give him a nice shot for that. Getting that save and then not only doing that, but also landing on the backboard and just recovering instantly is a skill that not a lot of players have. You only really find that at like pro and, and high SSL rank. I'll just shoot that right side. LCT's gonna have it, but Melodic, I gave him enough time that he could grab full boost and get on the ball to like pressure it, so it's exactly what he did. Oh no. Uh, I don't think that's in. Just hit that to the side. Need help. Okay, LCT drove up into the corner and Wellis hit it out, so. Nice. Alright, Wellis is all the way back. I tried to demo him. All right, good, good rush from Melodic. I'm just gonna fake that. I'm dead though. This is gonna be me off the spawn. I don't know if I can get back. Yeah, I can't. I don't know why Melodic was flipping in their corner there, but that's just unlucky. <coughs> I should have rushed back there. Um, the only way we get scored on there is straight up just me getting demoed, so. Really the one thing that I didn't want to happen happened. Wait, go. Oh, he, he backed off. Now you back off? Wait, shot? Bang! Nice. Good shot, Melodic. Let's go. Let's go. Also, I want you guys to know I wasn't actually, like, flaming him. I was just joking around there. Because some people perceive everything that I say or do as toxic. So, just got to clarify. Got to put that disclaimer out there. All right, GG. Good game number one. And I'll see you on game number two. All right, getting into game number two. Champions Field. And we got a lobby of nobody I've ever seen before. So we go from pros. We get we got Wellis, who's a bubble player. Melodic, who's a well-known player. And then we got LCT, who's obviously a pro. Literally at the major, right? And now we got Henry Hogel. 5-4-3-3-4-2-1-1-1-5-3. No diss to Henry Hogel. I'm sure he's the GOAT. It's just the, the contrast in these early season lobbies are crazy. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm just going to... All right, well, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, um, all right, well, I'm just gonna, yep, okay, there we go, cool, uh-huh, <laughs> oh, I love these lobbies, let's go, let's go, I'm gonna regret saying that, I'm guaranteed that I'm gonna regret saying that, but, good start, just get a free demo, I saw the other guy, like, completely stopped his momentum by breaking on the wall there, so I figured if I demoed the one guy, then he wasn't gonna be able to get back. That should pop up, so he can't score that immediately or even take it in towards the net. It should be a free ball for my teammate. Nice. I'll just wait here. He's going to have a double, so again, I'll just, just wait here. Right? It's not going to be too big of an issue. Hit the... Um, okay, that's not going to be good. No, I can't. Nice. Okay, I'm starting to think Henry Hogel might be a Smurf name, but I'm not really sure yet. Not gonna, not gonna accuse him one way or another until I see some more evidence. Just that many, that many random uh, numbers is kind of. Oh, I just totally messed up my teammate. Should be fine though. He can't score that unless my teammate lets him pinch it. Nice. Stay on an Asnus. One more. Whoa. Okay. What? Bro, that touch. That touch is so laggy. How did that even happen? All right, I'll take this and then let him go. Nice. Ow. Hopefully he can go. No! Oh, man, that could have been a good redirect. I just kind of hit it a little too high, obviously. I'm just going to play the ball here. No, don't go. Don't go. Let me go for you. I'm in front of you. Please. My friend. He can't go. Just, just 50 the ball. Nice. Very good play for my teammate. All right, free ball. Nice. Oh, he didn't even have boost. That was kind of risky. I mean, not really. Like, I kind of had to go there. 
Uh, cause I knew he wasn't going. But, it would have been bad if, if the other person inflicted with a little bit more power. Uh, he should have boost now. I know he didn't pick up that corner, but... Surely he has boost at this point. Alright, I'm just gonna keep on let him going. I'm literally just gonna sit here. I mean, I'm not... I need him to go again. I just need him- I just need him to keep going. Yep, thank you. Free ball. Maybe hit it up right. Probably shouldn't have went for that. I heard him jump, like, well before I did, but... You know what, I just kind of wanted to go. Good rush for my teammate there. Um... A little awkward here. No reason to, to really dive in at that. But that's fine. He should be able to at least get a 50 here, so I'll grab some boost. Alright, watch the demo. He's probably going to take it back. Hit it over him. Force this out. Oh no, my brother. Where are you going? Okay. Low boost here. Get it over? Okay. Because I landed on the wall there, I'm just able to recover super quickly. I'm just able to get back, get some boost. Then maybe he can stay on. Alright, he went. I don't know why, but he did. Timmy can turn on that fast, get a beat. Nice. I'm going to fake that. If he bangs it over, yeah. That's exactly what happened. Alright, he should have a free ball here. He's going to have a little bit of time. Nice. Good control there. I like to see him popping it up there rather than just like trying to take a shot or something like that. That's a, that's a sign of a potential, alright? <clears throat> alright, he can go. Oh, never mind. He did not want to touch the ball. It's okay. You know, touching the ball is uh, like, you know, it's... It's scary sometimes, okay? Hopefully that guy can... Nice, get one more. That should be fine. I'm just gonna wait. Nice. Again, like like when LCT got the flip reset, I know that that guy doesn't have a lot of momentum. So he's gonna have to get like a perfect like pinch or something with his wheels to get a shot very powerful there. And it's just not worth panicking and, and predicting that 1% shot compared to just sitting on the backboard and waiting. It's much more like high percentage that you'll be able to save the shot by waiting there. Like in that specific situation. Sometimes, yes, you have to rush. But other times, like in that situation, it's, it's just a lot easier to just wait. So, I do a lot of waiting in, in these like lobbies early season. Which is, is almost a bad thing because then I get into the higher up lobbies and the players are like, Oh my god, like dude, stop camping net. Like just go, like trust me. And, you know, sometimes I get into some trouble there, but in these lobbies it works really well. And most likely in your lobbies it will too. But anyways, we'll go right into game number three. I'll see you all then. Alright, getting into the last game of the video. Ooh, we get Chief Beef? No! Okay, Chief Beef and 5 up partied up. That's kind of scary. We got Saucy on our team. I don't know if this is the Saucy that I know, but I don't remember him having that high ping. So I think this might be a different Saucy. Not really sure, but either way, this is going to be a tough game. Chief Beef and 5 up are both pretty pretty high rated players uh, especially in the twos lobbies man these these guys are just twos demons especially chief beef man Th this guy right now he's probably on like a like a six hour long stream or something he's he's an absolute grinder if you guys don't know chief beef i think i've mentioned it before but make sure to go check him out he's the king he's the king on twitch i wouldn't be surprised if in two or three years from now he's one of the biggest streamers on the on the platform especially for rocket league i would not be surprised Clip. Nope. Okay, he can go, though. Nice. Hopefully he stays on. I'm just gonna wait on 5-ups touch here. Yeah. Ooh. That's not good. He missed. That is good. I'll wait. He can go again. Nice. I just gotta watch the shot here. I need him to... Yeah, I need him to, to help me out there and, and force the ball off of 5-up. Uh, him just sitting here is is uh, obviously I don't I don't think he had boost there, but I I have two options there: either rush him or hope that my teammate helps me. And obviously the better option would have been to rush because uh, my teammate was not coming in for help. I'm just gonna fake this. Although I'm gonna get demoed, I'm just gonna leave now. Nice, good shot. But Chief Peef is there. Right, I should be able to get this. Try to demo him again. Yeah, he didn't spawn there. Dude, I swear every time I try to do like a spawn demo, I've never gotten one. I don't think I've ever gotten a spawn demo in my entire like 6,000 hours. And I go for them quite often. <laughs> it's it's sad almost. I think people, people at this rank are just a lot more skilled at choosing where they spawn. 
Obviously, that's not actually a thing. If you guys can't tell, that was sarcasm. But, because I know I'm going to get some comments. They're like, what? You can't choose where you spawn? Oh my god, are you stupid? So, it's a need boost. No problem, no problem. I thought he was going to be able to... So, when I forced it there, I figured that he was going to be able to get a challenge. But I think he didn't have enough boost to actually get up to the ball. So... I was not aware. I also turned the wrong way here, so that might be a goal. It's not, thankfully. Good challenge there. I'm going to have to try and force this. He's probably going to beat me. Yeah, he does. But it should be a touch for Saucy. He's just got to go. Yeah, I, I mean, right there, it's it's like... I force the ball up. He's got to be ready for that. Um, either... Okay, he's bumping. I can't. And I missed the boost. Try to get it over him. I can't. Hopefully Saucy's getting back. Nice. I'll go. They're both up. Okay, I get a 50 on one, so he should be able to follow that. Hopefully he can just control the ball. Bro, what is... What the hell is guy doing? He might just be lagging. I'm not really sure. Yeah, that's probably the game. That was an unlucky third game. I mean, it is what it is. You know, it happens. You win some, you lose some. When you're playing against Chief Beef and, and five up, I mean, like I said, that, that was just, it's not going to be an easy game, but unlucky. He didn't really want to play. I didn't really want to play. It's, it's all good. We'll get right into the next video, which will be tomorrow. We're not going to get into another game. I'll see you all next time. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you all soon. Peace.